This is a short tutorial on how I construct a menu using Pictures to Exe version 7.07. .07. The tutorial has been made using Debut Video Capture software. We're assuming that um, you've got a series of Exe files that you want to put into a menu. I'm going to use an existing menu that I'm in the process of constructing for a show that I'm going to be doing next October. So I'll use that as a sample. Here we go now. Please note that the picture quality in this tutorial is not representative of pictures to Exe. It has been degraded by the screen capture process. Use the spacebar or taskbar to control the pace of the tutorial. Right, here's a view of my desktop and I've clicked on my link to Pictures to Exe and my Work in Progress folder. I've opened my existing menu that I'm going to show you how I constructed. First of all, I'm going to open the menu. Along the bottom of the screen there you can see the various components. We've got a blank slide, a short video clip, the title that I usually use, who it's for, a list of shows that uh, are in there, and finally the menu page. After the menu page there's a salutation, that's all folks and then a reminder of the next show and the final video clip and finally a blank slide. I'll just show you how that operates now. Click the toaster. This is a manual show. So the opening video clip plays. I'm skimming these through these pretty fast, so that's why it appears quicker than it normally would. This is the actual menu page. If I click on one of the shows, which is called Wet, unfortunately, the show opens, and I've clicked the Escape key now, and we've gone back to the menu page and I've clicked on the next show which happens to be Mary and Jeff's Russian Cruise Part 2. Right back to the Pictures to Exe makeup page. Clicked on the, the actual menu page and opened up in objects and animation the actual menu page. I'm now going to add a title to the existing ones. Right, so I'm here I'm clicking on the text button because I activate all my shows in a menu by a text which is usually the title of the show. Click on the properties tab. I've scrolled down to the text that I normally use and highlighted it. I'm now going to type in a title, my new show. I'm resizing it by dragging the bounding box and positioning it under the existing titles. Now we go across to the common tab, down to the action on mouse click button, down to the slideshow with return, activate that. Across to the box below there is a folder. Click on that and it opens the folder where the shows that I've already put in there So I've now linked the text my new show to that's the show that's opened. I'll just do that again now. Click the text box. Properties tab, font type, bold, scrub out text, type in another new show.
resize that and put it under my new show then back across to the common tab click the action on mouse click slideshow with return click the folder at the end of the open box select which show you want to link to that title click open and you'll see that the title is in that box now I'll just scroll through the uh, URL there so that you can see that the title is actually listed in that box Gangnam Style is the title of the next show so we'll close that down click the toaster Gangnam Style opens up so I'll click the escape key again Now I'm going to close the whole thing down without saving. Close the software down. And that's it. Hope that's been useful to people who haven't done their own menus before.